Research Lab OpenAI's top scientist has made a controversial claim, one that could drastically change the artificial intelligence market, and already has other scientists up in arms over this crazy concept. The largest neural networks may already be developing consciousness, many experts have already warned. OpenAI was founded in December 2015. Elon Musk, along with Sutz Gever, was one of the original founders and participated in the company's early days, out of his concern for the potential threat AI poses to humanity. According to Analytics Insight, Musk has warned that we need to be super careful with AI as they are potentially more dangerous than nukes. One of the founding goals of OpenAI was to develop artificial intelligence in a responsible manner, with the appropriate controls in place to ensure the technology doesn't get out of hand and become a threat. Since its founding, the organization has become one of the leaders in the industry, making Sutzgeber's statement all the more worrisome. Most experts believe machine consciousness is still some time off despite recent advances in AI development. As a result, it's unclear whether Sutzgeber's statement is meant to be taken literally or facetiously, or whether it was merely a prediction about what the future may hold. Of course, the other possibility is that Sutzgeber's role as the top scientist at one of the leading AI firms gives him an insight that few others have. If he really was being literal in his estimation, it is truly an ominous one. The fact that many experts believe AI consciousness is a ways off, is also an indication the industry still lacks the necessary safeguards, to prevent Musk's fears from coming true. As there are many hypothesized types of consciousness, there are many potential implementations of artificial consciousness. In the philosophical literature, perhaps the most common taxonomy of consciousness is into access and phenomenal variants. Access consciousness concerns those aspects of experience that can be apprehended, while phenomenal consciousness concerns those aspects of experience that seemingly cannot be apprehended, instead being characterized qualitatively in terms. We have already seen signs of artificial conciseness with OpenAI's GPT-3. GPT-3, Generative Pre-Trained Transformer 3, is a language model by OpenAI, an artificial intelligence research laboratory in San Francisco. It is the third version release and the upgraded version of GPT-2. Version 3 takes the GPT model to a whole new level as it's trained on a whopping 175 billion parameters, which is over 10x the size of its predecessor, GPT-2. The 175 billion parameter deep learning model is capable of producing human-like text, and was trained on large text datasets with hundreds of billions of words. This language model was created to be more robust than GPT-2, in that it is capable of handling more niche topics. GPT-2 was known to have poor performance when given tasks in specialized areas, such as music and storytelling. GPT-3 can now go further with tasks such as answering questions, writing essays, text summarization, language translation, and generating computer code. OpenAI is a pioneer in artificial intelligence research, that was initially funded by titans like SpaceX and Tesla founder Elon Musk, venture capitalist Peter Thiel, and LinkedIn co-founder Reid Hoffman. The nonprofit's mission is to guide artificial intelligence development responsibly, away from abusive and harmful applications. Besides text generation, OpenAI has also developed a robotic hand that can teach itself simple tasks, systems that can beat pro players of the strategy video game Dota 2, and algorithms that can incorporate human input into their learning processes. GPT-3 is one of the best language models that are basically deep learning models, capable of producing a sequence of text given an input sequence. These language models are designed for text generation tasks such as question answering, text summarization, and machine translation. Language models work uniquely in contrast to LSTMs by utilizing different units called consideration blocks, to realize which parts of a text arrangement are critical to focus on. GPT-3 is the third generation of the GPT language models made by OpenAI. The primary contrast that separates GPT-3 from past models is its size. GPT-3 contains 175 billion boundaries, making it multiple times as extensive as GPT-2, and multiple times as Microsoft's Turing NLG model. GPT-3 has 96 consideration blocks that each contain 96 consideration heads. At the end of the day, GPT-3 is essentially a monster transformer model. Presently, GPT-3 is not open source, 
and OpenAI chose to rather create the model accessible through a business API that you can see here. This API is in private beta, and that implies that you should finish up the OpenAI API waitlist form to join the shortlist to utilize the API. OpenAI additionally has an exceptional program for scholastic analysts who need to utilize GPT-3. To utilize GPT-3 for scholastic exploration, you should finish up the academic access application. Currently, the industry possesses the tools to create AI systems that display remarkable levels of understanding. Some existing programs show much resemblance to human-level reasoning, performance, and control on specific tasks. Integrating Aji into advanced tech systems will enable them to combine human-like flexibility and reasoning with computational advantages, such as near-instant recall and split-second number crunching. Furthermore, using this intelligence to control robots that are at least as dexterous and mobile as a person would result in a new breed of machines that can perform any task. Over time, these intelligence would be able to take over almost every role performed by humans. Certain experts believe that such rapid advancements in Aji could have two extreme conditions. Either it could make humans cheaper than machines, or enable them to become more efficient with such advanced AI systems alongside them. But it is for sure that the advent of such systems could make human labor obsolete. Artificial general intelligence also aids in several real-world industrial use cases. Scientists from large tech organizations are contributing to tackling climate change, while developing what is required to build Aji for weather prediction, and plasma control for fusion, which is a single source of clean and sustainable energy. Also, these models can help meteorologists provide forecast and aid decision-making for emergency services, energy management, and activation of flood warning systems, enabling better preparation and responses for extreme weather conditions. Aji systems can make more intelligent systems for advanced decision-making. While Aji may not have been realized so far, it does promise a world full of possibilities. But currently, the technology is facing several roadblocks. Besides responding to the effects of climate change, it is also crucial to sort out the resources from which these data are generated by scientists and researchers. The lack of a working protocol with such advanced artificial intelligence or machine learning networking is critical. This deficiency coerces systems to work as standalone models in a closed environment. Also, the communication gaps come in the way of seamless data sharing and the inter-learning of machine learning models. Organizational executives are now in the dark to integrate AI with their business operations to drive specific results. The lack of direction followed by the fact that only a limited number of people possessing the required skills to handle Aji machines makes the deployment of such systems quite costly.